Hello everybody, Andrew Majewski here with Dental L. So let's talk about children and the dental office. So some of the best things you can do for your child to have them, to give them the best start at having nice teeth, um, healthy teeth. So more importantly, you know, healthy teeth. So even age two, okay? So I like seeing children age two. So then that way they get comfortable with me. I can see sort of where they might be missing with their toothbrush. Um, if you are hopefully helping them where you just need to kind of help them more. So age two is perfect. Now I actually see children in their own home. So that way they're as comfortable as possible. They don't have to feel like they're going to a doctor's office to be examined because nobody likes that. I don't even like that. <laughs> but kids don't. But I find they are so much more comfortable if I come into their own home because they see me as, you know, visiting mom and then I just happen to be polishing their teeth or I'm just polishing mom's teeth. Um, cleaning mom's teeth and then they go oh who is this little guy so he comes with me everywhere and I can show kids how to use their toothbrush properly they always love seeing his teeth and going oh he has a little spot there let me just brush that off you know so they just love that um, but yeah actually his teeth are kind of dirty in some spots actually but so they love him and that helps too because when I come I bring him Plus I have a toy box and stickers. So kids love that. And the nice thing too is, you know, they get used to having somebody look at their teeth. Age two, I probably can't look too much, but I can at the very least show them this, you know, show them how to use their toothbrush and then I will give them a toothbrush and then they can show me on their teeth and then I can kind of have a look around, you know, top and bottom. It's perfect, works every time, it's awesome. And kids have a lot less dental anxiety now because I come to them. And then when they're old enough to understand that sometimes they have to go to an actual dental office to get work done, they're old enough to be like, okay, well, there's nothing to worry about. You know, I had the dental office come to me, now I have to go to them, that's okay. Because I can fix. Um, I focus on prevention. So I like to prevent cavities from happening, obviously, but things do happen. So, you know, kids aren't always able to, you know, like brush properly and parents help them, but it can be tricky. So if a cavity happens, I can actually, um, I could actually, um, um, fix a tiny cavity. So if it's not through a certain portion of the enamel yet, then I can actually fix that, which is so nice. So no needle, no high-speed handpiece, no noise, none of that. Because um, I became a restorative dental hygienist about four years ago. It doesn't seem to be as popular in Ontario, but that allows me to fix small cavity. So how do I do it is I have this little um, liquid, which I thought I brought with me, but I brought a toothpaste instead. So I don't know what I was thinking, but I do have a little um, liquid that I put a drop. So let's say they have a cavity here. So I put a drop on the tooth, let it sit for about six seconds, and then that's it. That will actually kill that cavity that is over here or you know, here, there, anywhere, if it's tiny enough, okay? So that's the key. It does actually help to take out that cavity, um, kill it, and then seal it up, so it's perfect. The only thing is, it does turn that area black. So what I can do too, is I will put a thin, um, tooth colored uh, filling material over top, but it's not perfect. It doesn't cover everything because it's meant to be temporary because it is for children. Because children can't sit still, right? Right, you guys? So imagine me trying to do a filling on a two year old. I have like 30 seconds, that's it. So the type of product that I use literally takes 30 seconds. I just mix it up. I put it over top. It does work with some saliva too because kids will be doing this, right? You know, they'll be doing that. So I just kind of stick it on and that's it. So that does help to cover that black area, but but some does still kind of shine through a little bit, but it does look a lot better than having this big cavity there because cavities turn yellow and then brown and then black. So that's what actually happens too. So yes, 
the stuff that I use does turn the area black, but there's no cavity there. So you don't have to worry about your, you know, child being in pain. So it's so much nicer. Um, obviously, if I do that on the back teeth, you can't actually see it. So people don't mind that, but it's the front ones. And I see the most cavities probably here. So I do try to cover that up as, as much as possible. So if you have any questions about that, let me know. But so, as I said, I do focus on prevention, but if your child does get a cavity, then I can do that. No needle, no high-speed handpiece, no noise, no nothing. So let me know if you guys have any questions. It takes me 60 seconds to put on that liquid to help to kill the cavity, and then another 30 seconds to place a filling over top but that's it. So kids are, you know, they do excellent with that. But speaking of prevention and that toothpaste, I have toothpaste now that can help to prevent cavities. This stuff is amazing because it's perfect for children. It has no, um, so it is, it contains um, xylitol. So 25%, I believe it contains xylitol. So you don't have to worry. This can be used on kids, you know, two years old, you can use it anybody. So it does help to prevent cavities, which kids use this because I have noticed a huge difference. Okay, you guys, if you, if you help them brush twice a day, they will not get cavities. I see such a huge, huge difference. So when I see kids who I have not seen them before, and they have a lot of cavities that I have to kind of fix with that little liquid, and then I put um, the filling over top, I say you need one of these toothpastes now to help to make sure that things stay perfect and no more cavities. So I hope that helps you guys. Thank you so much for watching. And if you would like me to come see your child, let me know because he will be coming with me. So thank you guys. Have a nice day. Bye.